years ago when uh, I had my near-death experience and God saved me. The, the incident wasn't necessarily towards me, but but the bullet still could have went and hit me. I was at my grandmother's house and we was having a little get together. You know, the neighbors were having their little cookout and my family was having a little cookout. And it was in a duplex apartment. And then we just hear a gathering and argument going on in the backyard in a, in a small parking lot. And they're arguing and then they're basically threatening each other about hitting each other and you're not going to do anything. And then you see one guy go into the house talking about how he's going to get a gun. He's like, yo, what are y'all going to do now? What are y'all going to do now? And then one guy, like everybody's backing up, then one guy comes out of nowhere and then like punches the guy in the face with a gun. And then he backs up and starts to square up and starts to put up his hands. And then the guy like turns his head a little bit, acts like he was thinking about something, and then he starts to shoot the gun. He did not stop shooting for about a minute straight. Like I was about two yards away and the gun was pointed about 40 degrees the other way. And I'm two yards away, so he could have turned at any time and shot towards my direction. So I just thank God that he saved me from that. Yeah, at any chance, he could have just turned towards my way. But thank God that I wasn't able to get shot by the bullet. And thank God that he protected me and kept me safe from all the dangers. So that was my near death.